Hey folks, I'm Steve Bliskus with Mount Comfort RV and today I want to show you a new unit we just got in, the Brookstone Chaparral 324 TSRK, that's triple slide, rear kitchen. Let's start with the front. You'll see Chaparral is started with a very nice white front cap nowadays and that's going to uh, eliminate your sun exposure, allowing uh, less heat to get in. You'll see a very aggressive front cap. It's going to allow you to use a regular hitch on this with a short bed truck. Taking a look under here. Tons of room for any more storage you may need. It does have dual 30 pound propane bottles. There's one on the other side. This unit is very lightweight at 10,600 pounds also, by the way. You'll notice a ton of very clean pass-through storage. You're gonna see aluminum foil bubble wrap here. Um, aluminum studs going all the way through, battery disconnect, and also you're going to see your wet, bar, your wet bay right here. So we're going to be able to antifreeze for the uh, winter time, hooking up cable, everything else. 10 gallon gas electric direct spark ignition hot water heater. This coach does have 50 amp service, so if you do want to add that second AC, you can. You'll notice we have beautiful aluminum wheels under here. These do come in with the bike rack, so if you want to put coolers back there, bikes, firewood, you most certainly can. You'll notice you have four ports for your refrigerator because we have two in there. I'm going to show you that when we get in. And also one thing I want to point out, Coachman uses Asdell, so any laminated product has the possibility of delamination, but Coachman, since 07, has been putting their fiberglass on top of a man-made backer called Asdell. 50% lighter than wood, twice as strong, puncture resistant, actually has a better R factor, and uh, the best thing about it is it can't rot if water gets in. You may accidentally let your roof leak. Um, Luon punishes, punishes you for it, while Asdell just lets your fiberglass adhere perfectly to it since it won't rot. Taking a look at the front, you notice you do have outdoor speakers here, a place to set your television. And you'll also notice you have LED strip lighting under the awning. Folks, we're inside the 334 TSRK now. And first off, I want to focus on the best part of this coach right here is the double door refrigerator. Now, excuse me, two double door refrigerators. Sorry, we're not exactly completely level right here, but you can see that right there. These are both nine cubic foot. So that's gonna give you a total of 18 cubic feet of space in here. You notice a massive amount of storage space. This is hardwood to, uh, excuse me, four person dinette with storage under the chairs. Taking a look at the kitchen, you will see just a huge amount of storage, or excuse me, counter space here with pull out faucet. A stone cast sink, so you don't have to worry about those hot pots and pans melting plastic. They've put the glass cover on their stove. It's a lot nicer than the metal cover. It doesn't rattle around and holds up a lot better. You notice some beautiful open face smoke glass doors with tons of storage inside here. And here is another awesome feature. Look at that pantry. That should be in a motor home fifth, or excuse me, a high class motor home pantry right there. Three pull-out drawers, plenty of space to put all your goodies for the kitchen in there. And just come around and take a look, actually what's gonna feel like to be inside the island of this kitchen. Excuse me, the peninsula. Look at that. All plywood right here, tongue and groove. They've even put that storage in there for you. That is awesome. Under the sink, they've left it open for a trash can. And furthermore, if you'll take a look down here, there's no carpet in the slide. Where are the spills going to happen? It's going to happen in the kitchen, but with no carpet, you got nothing to stain. And one thing I forgot to point out, take a look at this backsplash. One of my personal pet peeves you can ask anybody here is paper backsplash. I don't understand, but Coachman has done a beautiful job with a real backsplash behind their kitchen. All right. Taking a look to the other side. 
You're going to see additional cabinetry up here, the same beautiful smoke glass doors. Two wonderful recliners. Coachman's been using a lot more residential feel um, curtains around their windows as opposed to the block lambrequins you see very often nowadays. And if you will take a look up top, you're going to see LED lighting is standard now in your 2015 Coachman's. Take a look, you do have the 5K fireplace under there. It's like a nice space heater. Does come with TV, Jensen uh, DVD stereo system. And uh, one of my favorite features is a wonderful um, recliner built into this L shaped sofa to watch the TV. And if you do have anybody stay the night here, you do have a tri fold sofa right here. And as you see, I don't know if you can see this in there, there's hangers for coats. So many times you come in, you don't know where to put your coat because there's no place for it. Well, on this one, you got it. Taking a look up, uh, walking up here to the bedroom. If you'll notice the bathroom, a 10 gallon hot water heater is no fun if you don't have a nice big shower. So there's plenty of room here also with a seat for ladies to shave their legs, put um, shampoo up there, anything you might need. And you'll see in here, a place for towels. Okay. Moving on up to the bedroom, you'll notice we do have this one optioned in with a king size bed, two windows on each side of the bed. If you want pass through uh, air at night, you can open those both up and get it. You can put a TV in here. And that's all the drawer space you have. And that's hardwood right there, folks. None of that wrap stuff. You will also see storage under the bed. And you'll see we do have the Serta mattress on this puppy, so you don't need to go out and buy another mattress because it's got that usual no good RV mattress. <laughs> and you can't see it from here, but there are outlets um, on each side of the bed. Place for coats, and you also have a light on the inside. That is LED. Place for shoes underneath. I stepped in front of that there. Hold on, we're locked. There we go. And if you did want to put a combo washer dryer unit in here, you most certainly could. And if not, it's just more storage for clothes and what have you. All right, folks, well, I just want to show you the uh, wonderful new 324 TSRK with the two massive fridges, plenty of counter space, wonderful seating area, and plenty of storage in this puppy. So if you get a chance, come out here, take a look at it. We are having our end of the year sale going on right now, so you can get some great prices. And my name's Steve. If you have any questions, give me a call, 317-898-6676. Thanks a lot and have a great day.